I'm Sue. Hi, Sue. Hi. Um, Jimmy got the Purple Heart, you know, over 50 something years ago oh. when he met up with an AK. And, um, but what we're celebrating now, and it's been in the paper and on the news, is he was nominated by a Marine uh, to represent the whole state of Massachusetts, and he got the not the nomination and we're going on Monday uh, to the Purple Heart Honor Mission. It's five days in New York, all expenses paid. Uh, we're going to the Statue of Liberty, we're going to uh, the Purple Heart Museum, we're going to West Point to have dinner with the cadets. And you know, it's a long time coming. And you know, he, this is, what a lot of them refer to is the welcome home they never got. And I know that because I'm also the sister of a paratrooper that was in Vietnam. Yeah, yeah. And um, so off we go on Monday. It's a really, really big deal. There's gonna be one Purple Heart recipient from every state in the Union. And uh, it's supposedly something really fantastic. We're also going to the 9-11 Museum. Uh, the Statue, I said the Statue of Liberty, so um, I can't wait, you know, and uh, th in this year Jim will nominate someone for next year, whether they get it, that's up to the, uh, the group that decides who gets it, but this corpsman here, who served with the Marines, will be getting it, um, will be honored uh, Monday through Friday in New York. So that's it. <laughs> so my name is Gina Nelson. I'm the executive director of the Veterans Lunch Program. Jim Bouchard is a long, long time member of the of the program. And so we have awarded him today. It does not compare by any means to any recognition for the Purple Heart. But this is Jim Bouchard Day. And so we have a certificate formalizing that. And um, he forgot the medal, but he has it on his hat and on his shirt. And so we celebrate you today. So is there anything that you wanted to say? Uh, the National Purple Heart uh, Honor Mission. I was nominated by a friend of mine, John Hurley, who's been here. And he was number two, I'm number three. This is the third year that we're doing this in recognition for services those that were wounded in combat. So, uh, I'm really honored and I want to thank you so much. How did you obtain the Purple Heart? How did I obtain it? I was uh, caught in an ambush. I was diving over a wounded Marine and I got uh, an AK round inside of my chest. That's how I received it. And where was this? A Hop Duck Valley. We called it Death Valley, August 25th, 1969. You must have been scared out of your mind. That's that's beside the point. It was uh, more than scared, yeah. yeah. And, uh, you know, I, survived, I survived that, and I, and, I, and I survived 20 years of PTSD. I came down to Western Massachusetts for PTSD program, and I and I stayed here. It's been 31 years. I met a lot of veterans, and I try to help out as many as I can. What an honor! Thank you, Jim, honey. You can have a seat now.